so welcome to the Instagram live today. I got a, little, a few things going on at my house. I have someone drilling for electricity. The front door is opening. People want the cars moved. So there are there is some noise in the background today. But all you got to focus on is this core workout we're going to do. So thank you guys for coming. Now, if you want to get updates on when we're working out, who we're working out with, etc., you can just go into the link in bio and check out that whole deal. Sign up for email updates so you'll know what we're doing today. Um, Harry is probably going to join me today, my little tiny dog. He's at the front door, but you'll see him making a cameo here and there. Maybe a few people walking in the background. Now today we're going to hit the flow. We're going to get on the floor. We're going to work out a little bit. So what you'll need today is some sort of band. Now I'm using our nifty 11 bands. Unfortunately, these are sold out. I think we have a few bands on our website. And then I'm also using this band here. But you can also use some hand weights if you have those. If you do not have one of these... You can just tie a knot on one of these and you've got that, right? So that's what we're gonna use today. We're gonna start with core. So let us go ahead and get started. And let me see if I've got the right angle. Um, just kind of bending it down so you can see me as we work out on the floor. I think that works. All right, so I've got my little list here, and we are gonna start with the bands around our legs. Hey, how are you? Hello. Yeah, go on through, no problem. Okay. Thanks. So we're gonna start with the bands around our legs. We're gonna run through everything one good time. We're not doing twice today, because we're gonna do a variety of exercises in the same areas. So we're gonna put the band on to the legs, and we are going to bridge up. So bridge up, and then we're gonna let one leg fall in and one leg fall out. So I'm gonna turn this way so it's a little easier for me to see. Oh, there's my dog. So you're gonna bridge up, one leg goes in, and then out. Okay, so we're gonna do 15 of those. There we go. I think that's four. Harry, how's your day? So Harry and I spend the whole day together. I take him to practice. Then we go to the gym. So I just rolled in from my own workout. I think we got like five left. And oh hi buddy. Oh you got terrible breath. Okay, now we're gonna just bridge up and down. So make sure you're applying pressure on this band and just bridge up and down. So let's say you do not have a band. That's okay too. Just go ahead and keep bridging up and down. So that's five. We're gonna do 15. Make sure you get all the way up and get the range. You probably are feeling a burn now. And why are we doing these? Because I need to do these. Harry's living the good life. He jumped on the chair. And I've also lost my list. Huh. There it is. All right, so we got those bridge ups and downs. And now we are going to do a bridge. And this is where this band's going to come in. So if you have some weights, you can also use the weights. And so just. Get a little of this under your body because we're going to do a, a chest press with this. So we're going to bridge up and then we're going to have a chest press. I think I'm going to have to put it under like my toes actually. It's better if you have a free weight. I just didn't get mine out of the garage in time. <laughs> I'm running from place to place quickly. Okay, so we're going to bridge up. And then you can just press up. If you have a weight, we can do a chest press. If you have a band, you can do a shoulder press. So bridge up and chest press up. Bridge up, chest press up. I'll try to change the angles so you can see it a little better. Bridge up, chest press. Kind of a shoulder and a chest press. Okay, 
Okay, well done on that one. Now, I have a second band, but like I said, if you don't have one, just go ahead, make a hole like this, double tie a quick knot like so, and you've got your band, okay? So now we're just gonna do a little shoulder work, a little tricep work. So, we're gonna continue with the bridge. We're gonna bridge up, and we're gonna pull the band out, and just keep pulsing. Then we're gonna go overhead. Well done. Now we're gonna put one hand in front, one hand behind, and we're gonna be able to do the tricep. So just give yourself some resistance and keep bridging. We're gonna do eight on each side. And switch. All right, I think we did really well on the glutes. Now we're gonna just do a little bit of core and we're gonna finish it off with some back. So we're gonna straight go with just some straight run of the mill sit-ups, okay? So go ahead and sit up for, let's say 25. Well done, two, three, four, five is the last one. So today I had to do pike planks. You go to a pike, do a lot of those. We're not doing those today. Um, we're gonna do some hundreds though. So now legs are gonna go on tabletop and then we're just gonna push forward with the palms up for one, for 10 and then palms down for another 10, I've lost count, thumbs up for 10. Well done. That's 40. We're over halfway done. Palms back up. And then one more time. Switch position. I think that's a little better like that, right? And then we're going to do 10 more and put the palms up. And 10 down. Palms back down. Well done. So now we're going to go to the side. We're going to get a little oblique. And then we're going to go into inner thigh. I think the inner thigh exercises we're gonna do are a lot of fun. So, uh, just go into your side and we're gonna just meet our elbow to the opposite knee. And it's really easy and it's gonna burn. Now, if you guys like my gear, I'm wearing the um, Women by Venus Wonder Woman collection and because the Wonder Woman 84 movie just came out, which I heard is fire. My family and I wanna watch it together. So just go ahead and let the elbow try to get to that knee. I think we'll just do like 20 of those. It's all good fun, right? Okay. Now, while we're there, I'm gonna to have to turn a little bit because it's very tall. So we're gonna stay in that position and we're gonna let, we're gonna go ahead and cross this leg over. And it's not great, I hope you guys can see. I think that's better. So we're gonna cross this leg over and then we're gonna raise the other leg up. So we're gonna do 30 of those. That's 10. So I need to get closer to the chat so I can see what you guys are saying. Cause I can't see it. 
So you should feel a little bit of a burn there. If you don't, then I'm not sure what to tell you. You're not doing it right, but if you keep trying, you'll get there. Now we're gonna do the other side. more. Next time I'm going to play music. I have a great idea. Play music next time. Okay, so same thing. The top leg goes on top, bottom leg is under, and we're going to raise it up for 30. And we're going to bring this side out because next we're going to do another inner thigh exercise. Okay, so your top leg is gonna be straight and your bottom leg is gonna meet the top leg. Gotta meet them, not halfway. Bottom leg is gonna meet the top one all the way. And we're gonna switch, get to the other side. So I'm not sure what you guys are looking forward to next year. I think I'm looking forward to playing tennis. Now, when we go to Australia, we have a two week quarantine. I'm gonna be so happy to be in Australia. <laughs> Just gonna eat those two weeks for lunch. Okay, so now we're gonna progress into another inner thigh series. So what we're gonna do first, we're gonna go down, and we're just gonna let this leg drop out and let the other one drop out. And now we're gonna lift the leg and let it drop out to the bottom. And so we'll let this one drop out. Let's do five times. So that foot is off of the ground. It's not on the ground, it's off of the ground. Now I want you to straighten the leg. And we're gonna go in and out for five. Now we're gonna go up and down at an angle. So down and up for five. So you should really feel that bird. Well done. Same thing on the other leg. So you're gonna have that foot in the air, not too high, hovering off the ground about you know two or three inches and then let it drop. So let your leg drop out. five. The leg goes straight now and we're going to go in and out for five. And then we're going to go up and down for five. Well done. All right, we're going to finish with a little back. So we're gonna do some Supermans, but also we're gonna do some side. I guess that's a QL as an oblique. So we're gonna go, your legs are gonna be just on top of each other or just besides each other like so. And we're gonna let ourselves go down, go as far as you can and support yourself. And then we're gonna raise up for 10. So she's a superman. I believe I can fly. Okay, and then now we're gonna go side to side. Like you're looking for trouble. You're on the horizon and you're looking for like, where are the bad people? I'm flying, protecting my city. Where are they? And then up and down for 10 more. Well done. Now back to the side. And we're gonna go down as far as we can and then back up. It's just a tiny little movement. So it's here actually getting the opposite side. 
It's like defying gravity. Impossible to do it. Last one. Switch. This side is personally easier for me. My hip flexor is stronger. And I can go a lot further. So challenge yourself as far as you can. Do two more. Well done. So, we just completed a very quick, and I'm gonna let my camera down. So I got my phone hydraulics here. Ooh, 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 ooh. Get that good. Did that. Okay, so guys, I hope you really enjoyed our workout today. I was working my way to you. I was on the course and in the gym and made my way here. And now is the time where we answer some questions. So I guess I hope you enjoyed this workout. Now remember that you can go to the link in bio and opt in for email updates. So you can get updates on when we're working out, who we're working out with, and what time we're working out. And usually we're doing about once a week on Wednesdays. So I'll be again with you next Wednesday for that good, good, good workout. And if you like what I was wearing today, this Wonder Woman collection, all the stars, and all some glitter, you guys can get that on 11bardinas.com to celebrate the new movie coming out and just be fabulous with stuff you want to wear. Okay, so Ann Walden says, make us proud in Australia, I promise. And um, M to the O, hello, how are you? I was practicing, it was really good, actually. I'm making progress, I have to say. I'm working hard on everything. And I mean, um, it's always good to evolve, so I'm working on that. Someone's like, what's my email? 555 Venus. And let's see, I'm going to go to the question box, guys. What's my plan for the 2021 season? I don't have a plan because I don't know what's gonna happen. So in the case that these tournaments go down, I'm ready. If they don't, I'll be good. I'll be at home with you doing probably extra, extra workouts, still training, spending time with my team. So if it happens, I'm gonna be there. But so far it looks like uh, we're gonna get to go to Australia. Hopefully it'll happen. Okay, more questions in the question box. My goals for 2021. Get to know my neighbors. I just said that today. I was like, I want to know my neighbors. That's a simple goal, but I can't because I moved and I can't because it's COVID. So I do not know any of my neighbors. So hopefully that'll happen. Of course, I want to win big on the court, be healthy and help people to be healthy. So that's why we're here today. Some of my goals. Nice to see you, Kim. Guys, I'm hungry, I gotta eat. Um, We need Wonder Woman men's. I know, right? We should have done some baseball caps at the very least. So I agree with you. We're working on it. We're gonna get it right, I promise. Okay, some of you guys are so supportive of me. Thank you, because you've noticed. And someone wants a 2021 match with my sis. Someone's like, oh, how do you like your new serve? I like it a lot. Um, I can't keep up, I can't keep up. Do I live near my sister? Yes. Um, how do you stay strong during an adversity? Because the same amount of time that you can be weak, you can be strong. So do the math. Just go ahead. It's going to be fine, I promise. We all have adversity. It's just how life goes. But it's not all the time. There's a lot of beautiful stuff, too. What's my favorite show right now? So I've been watching the Golden Girl. This show is funny. <laughs> but also with my sister yesterday, I came home and she was watching, this is my older sister, Lynn, and she's watching the new show on Netflix, that period film, Beddington House. I can't remember the name. I actually couldn't wait, so I had to see what happened. I Googled it because I know there's books and what have you. So I already know the spoilers, but I keep my mouth shut. I'm not ruin anyone else's movie watching. Favorite vegan dish? I love a smoothie, so you guys gotta check out our Happy Viking smoothies on um, 11 by this guy. 
you know, a text. Hi, Venus. Everything's done. I'm ready for the new year. So, yeah, check out our uh, Happy Vikings movies on Amazon.com. Those are great. And I like to throw some strawberries in mine, some dates, blend it up. You got a good shape. But also right now, I'm killing it on veg veggie tacos. That's my favorite thing right now. Uh, let's see. Um, someone asked a question I don't understand. I'm sorry. Mm. What am I working on on the court? So I'm keeping it pretty simple right now. Working the same things over and over again, serves, returns, uh, lots of technique work, approach shots, volleys. I did hit volleys today. I was like, oh shoot, did I, I hit volleys? I hit volleys. It's so windy right now though. It's killing a sister. Okay, next. Yeah, everyone keeps asking me about my serve. What's your favorite animal? This thing. This is my boy. He's my thing and my monster. He's very picky. He knows what he wants. He's a boss. Don't let this innocent face fool you. He's a monster. You just wouldn't know it. Okay, monster? Okay. He came to visit, so he's not too terrible. Okay. Will I play doubles in the Australian Open? I don't know. I hope so. Thank you. He's cute. He's a cute little kid, huh? He's 13. Uh, he's a good kid. Okay, let's let's answer a few more questions. How often do I meet Serena nowadays? So I saw Serena last on my Monday? Sunday. What is today? Wednesday? Oh, and I just missed her on Monday. So I was about to go see her and she leaving the flat space I was going to so I was like ah so maybe I'll run by her place today also I love seeing the baby so that's important and I'm not sure what I've done here is he a schnauzer my boy is a um Havanese and he was impulse by and ran out with a dog I was like what have I done what does Olympia call me right now? She calls me Vivi. And sometimes she throws me shade too, but I love that. Okay. What's my favorite tournament? Anyone I'm winning. And anyone that knows me knows the answer to that question. Whatever I'm winning. Okay. Yeah, of course. Hell yes. I love, well, I love her. <laughs> But also she's my favorite player and she's a lot of fun and very protective. Yeah. Did I mention she's a lot of fun? She's a lot of fun. Okay. What's my favorite sport besides tennis? Of course, I love American football. I actually love table tennis. I love track and field. Those are probably the ones I love. And last but not least, let's pick one more good question. Okay. I don't know if this is a good question, but it's a question. Oh, actually, I like this one. Do I like Harry Potter? Okay, so yeah, I do. I read Harry Potter ages ago when it first came out, like 2000 or something. It's been a long time. Can you imagine? But today I was thinking, um, you know how they have those wooden rackets? And I wondered if each racket was a little bit different. So you go pick out your wood like you did the wand on Harry Potter and you like, Pick out a spruce wand because you know this and that and the other remember when harry got his wand he had the same one as voldemort so anyway when you picked your wooden rackets back in the day you like pick the wood and this one had more zip or whatever i don't know i don't know why i was thinking about that practice i need to get my mind on the game okay um let's see there's one i was looking for that i can't find now there's just so many questions Um, let's just go this way. Favorite city in Asia? Two. Hong Kong and Beijing. I love Hong Kong. So fun. I love running in that city. Just take off and go, I don't know where. Just an adventure. And uh, I do love Hong Kong. I mean, Beijing a lot because I have friends there and I love to go and eat. 
I haven't won a lot of matches there. That's the sad part, but I did have a lot of good times. Oh, this is a great question. Favorite songs right now. So my favorite songs right now are Jewelry by Blood Orange, The Distance by Yeba. What else am I listening to? Those are my two favorite songs at this moment. So very random. And... Oh, someone's asking me about this backhand online I hit against Azarenka. Yeah, I remember that. But only because people tag me on it all the time. Not because I remember it. I guess now, yeah, I remember it happening. Okay, guys, so many questions. Thank you so much for all the questions. I actually, I have to get ready for my physical therapy at 4 o'clock. So i got to wipe off all this dirt and sweat and try to get presentable. So... Harry, you want to say bye? Puff wants to say bye. He's just staring at me. He did no sit-ups. What a weenie. What a weenie. So, guys, go check out the Wonder Woman Collection, 11byvenus.com. Get your stars. And I will see you next week. But, of course, watch my stories throughout the week. And you guys have a beautiful next year. Be safe and be well. Don't do anything I wouldn't do. Bye.